You have to have guts to call in poker. We've all had moments when we didn't have enough faith in our cards to win a hand. Today, we'll be talking about the hero call and looking at some examples. Call. He calls! Oh, what a call! Wow! Oh, what's oh, a call? But before we do, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of the new videos coming soon. This is Poker Time. Let's get started. Experienced players know you can't win with cards alone. Without using concepts like value bet, bet sizing, and equity, it's practically impossible to stay ahead over the long run. By combining all these concepts, we get the hero call. The hero call is that brilliant moment when you see your opponent's bluff and call their bet with a weak hand. Only master poker players are capable of pulling off the hero call. However, it's best not to confuse the hero call with a I just refused to believe you had a stronger hand call. I'm all in. Phil shoves! I call. And Daniel calls! Set. Set's good. In this hand at the final table of the 2015 EPT, Seidel shows us the true artistry of poker. The hand started with a standard call and check on the big blind. Check. Eric Seidel has a jack and four of diamonds in his hand. And we can't see Urbanovich's cards to keep the intrigue high. The dealer reveals an ace of spades, a six of spades, and an ace of diamonds. At first glance, it might look like a bad board for Eric, but for poker powerhouses like him, it opens a world of possibilities. With Urbanovich's call on the small blind, Seidel can count on him not having a strong hand or high cards. Sure, his opponent could have a monster hand, like pocket aces or kings, but the likelihood is so small Seidel can't judge based on that alone. Next. We see a check from Urbanovich, giving Eric the chance to see the turn for free. It reveals the King of Diamonds, which opens up even more room for him to maneuver. Hello, flush draw. Finally. Here comes a bet from Urbanovich. Now Seidel can afford a semi-bluff or call a bet with a flush draw, which he does. Another important thing to note here is that the Jack and Four of Diamonds became blocker cards on the turn. However, it still leaves Urbanovich with the ability to semi-bluff on the spade flush draw. This is a good time to take a look at our Poker Time Tips section. Blockers are cards that reduce the chances of your opponent forming a combination. In our case, the two diamond cards greatly reduce Urbanovich's chance of a flush. Now, we know Urbanovich can only have two out of nine diamond cards, instead of two of eleven. Blockers can always be utilized. For example, with an ace-king suited, the chances of your opponent having pocket aces and kings are much lower. Plus, we can be sure they don't have a nut flush. Let's go back to our hand, where the dealers just revealed the five of hearts, which does nothing for either of the draw combinations. These cards are called blanks. Seidel checks. Urbanovich bets 525k. And Urbanovich responds with a bet. Maybe Seidel thought that with a pair in his hand, Urbanovich wouldn't raise to avoid a check-raise situation, and the flush draws are still incomplete. A queen high would also give Urbanovich a win. So, given Seidel's passive game, the check was the logical move with a weak pair or a queen high. Only after a detailed analysis of the hand do we see that a bet on the river could likely mean a weak hand for Urbanovich. I still can't quite believe he is thinking about calling this. He's called with Jack High. Makes a call I wouldn't make. And he's right. And wins a pot I wouldn't win. With a big pot, Seidel didn't seem to think Jack High was too weak a hand for a hero call. I hope you see now the hero call requires a lot of skill. Poker really is the most spectacular card game. And that's why we've chosen the top three hero calls just for you. Number three. My nothing is better than your nothing. I went really quick for my chips there. <laughs> and then I thought, hmm, what are the odds that Tony has a 10, a jack, a jack, a two, or a six? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> As the kids say these days, your range is polarized. Either I have a monster, which would be a two, 
or you have nothing. <laughs> just, you know I don't entirely agree with that, but I love the call. Nothing, <clears throat> Good call. Wow. Oh, yeah. Number two, the sickest read. Chen should be ditching this right about now. But he's not. I know he's not calling. Well, this is certainly a bluff. A raise to more than 1.5 million. To be perfectly honest, there are tons of hands Andrew could have here that have ace three beat. Tons. Katai is not taking his gaze off Chen at all. It's like me with a chubby redhead. This will be some kind of absolute sick soul read. Awesome call alert. Agreed. I don't know how often Ace Trey is going to be good in that spot, but it's infrequently enough that I'm confident in saying that is a losing play in the long run. But Davide Katai just made a soul read on par with Mystic Meg. Katai went on to win the title and earn that coveted triple crown. Number one. I can't respect myself if you bluff me. He knows, he just knows if he bets 50k, I'm going to call him. That's why he does this. This has to be a bluff. Guys, this has to be a bluff. Like, if you bet 50k, I was gonna call you and you figured that out. These guys have spent so much time together. <laughs> That's why I just gotta do it. Why are you so smart? I don't think I could respect myself tomorrow if you bluffed me here. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it boils down to. Some things are more important than money in life. <laughs> I mean, he is so cool. I, 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 I didn't know he was capable of this. Definitely very capable. See, he's really the cool. best! Oh my god. He is the best! Oh my god. Wow. He did it. He did it. Rest he is the best! He's the best! You're the best! I knew he was going to call Premier 50, League. so I went This is the guy at the bottom of the board. You gave it away, Dan. That was his Premier League. Nobody likes parting with their chips. So build those poker skills, because those are what will help you win. Good luck with your hero calls. See you on Poker Time. Good luck, guys.